Yes, I'm still here. How you doing? It's your girl, Jeray. Thank you for coming to Jeray's space. I'm about to talk about forgiveness. That's what a lot of people don't like to do, and I include me. So we're going to talk about how we need to do what we need to be forgiven. And let's get right on into it. You forgiveness that's a touchy subject okay it's touchy okay but um forgiving yourself sometimes is the worst um there's times you've disappointed yourself like dang i've done that a lot still do it uh there's times where you know forgive yourself for times when you were wrong sometimes we're just wrong and i like i'm a person i like being right i ain't gonna lie I ain't got to rub it in your face, but I do like being right. But I don't want to argue about it either, though. Like, I'm not going to argue down just to say that I'm right. But, like, if I'm right, I'm right. Like, I'm not going to just, like, I'm going to play with you. But sometimes we're real wrong. So, admitting to that, forgive yourself for sometimes you're wrong. Forgive yourself for the time you feel like you weren't enough. Sometimes we struggle with that. Like, am I enough? Like, for whatever the case may be. You are. But forgive yourself for thinking you wouldn't. That you wasn't enough okay forgive yourself forgive yourself for things that you said out of anger because you know we can say some rough stuff when we pissed <sighs> please just it happens when we can control some stuff i have a video about controlling things but we have said some things out of anger Forgive yourself for that, though. You know, uh, forgive yourself for past mistakes you made. They're now lessons. You know, they're lessons. We learn from them. We make mistakes. We're imperfect. Forgive yourself for that. Um, forgive yourself for times where you could have been a little bit empathetic, more empathetic, more sensitive to someone's needs, or more sensitive to them, and you wasn't. Forgive yourself because sometimes we get caught up in our own stuff. And we might say the wrong thing to somebody. We could have been more sensitive about it, more empathetic, and we wouldn't. But forgive yourself for that. Forgive yourself when for realizing you were the toxic person. Nah, no, I'm not toxic. <laughs> but I have been in toxic situations. So I'm going to forgive myself for being in toxic situations before. But I don't like toxic people. I'm not here for none of that. So, but, you know, if you have been, I'm not like pointing no fingers, but if you have been or you've been known for it and somebody says you toxic, like if you heard that, then more from more than like two people that you might have been or is a good too toxic, but forgive yourself. You're going to learn to be a better you, hopefully. Forgive yourselves for the lessons you learn a little too late. Sometimes we missed out on a situation that, dang. I didn't catch that. I didn't I didn't jump on that like I should have. I didn't do that, but it's okay. It happens to the best of us. We sometimes do that, but um forgive yourself for that. Move on and just learn to catch stuff when you can. If this is a good opportunity, jump on it. If this is a good person, jump on it. Friends, relationships, whatever. You better jump on it while you can. Or you be looking cray cray later on, like woulda, coulda, shoulda, and end up with somebody you don't want to be with or have some friendships that you probably shouldn't have because you didn't jump on that friend that was a good friend to you or that man or that girl was a good girl to you or a woman to you or a good man and you messed out because you was on whatever you was on forgive yourself for that it happens to the best of us um forgive yourself for not standing up for yourself it's been times that you probably have not and I have not stood up for myself but you know what I was like not no more I'm saying enough for me. Because ain't nobody going to have me like me. People that you think have your back don't have your back sometimes. That's just realness. That's not positive. That's not negative talk. That's just a real thing. Some people that say they rock with you ain't really rocking with you. You do know that, right? And that's a reality. But stand up for yourself. Stand up for yourself. I don't care what situation you in. You better stand up for you. You are your own advocate. You better do the right thing. Like Spike Lee. So those are some things that you just need to um, 
that I wanted to bring to the fore table about forgiving yourself for some things and uh, learning, growing as an adult. We probably been an adult for years and still don't have it down, do we? But it's okay because we go get down. Thank you for tuning in. Please hit the notification bell for my uh, for to always check so you can always get my videos as soon as they pop out. And uh, you know I'm at Dre Space on IG. And I always try to have some inspiring words for you guys. Oh, so thank you so much for tuning in. I'm tired. I've been videoing all day. And I just want to chill for the rest of my Sunday. Hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend or your day or work day or whatever it is. I hope this was able to make you feel better. Thank you. I look for you in another video. Peace out.